Hey guys, it's Dan, your host of Dan's Reviews, and today I'm back for another Walking Dead Spotlight video for this week. This one is going to be doing a Connie character spotlight video. So, wanted to of course do our weekly Saturday spotlight for this week for The Walking Dead. This one is an awesome one. This is uh, this is one I was super excited to do when I got this suggestion. Uh, a Connie character spotlight video. Now, uh, this one probably won't be too long because she's only been in the series for a little while, but... She is an awesome character and definitely, uh, you know, a character to, uh, you know, keep in the show because she, she's a character that's a, a big fan favorite already from Magnus Group. So, uh, I want to just apologize quickly for the, the quality of the video. It's a bit darker, uh, yeah, today just because it's, uh, it's raining outside and, Usually it's sunny out and there's a lot of lighting and stuff like that, but uh, yeah, today it's a bit of a rainy day outside. So uh, yeah, because we're getting the rest of the uh, the hurricane here, so it's kind of like uh, a little bit of you know uh, you know a little bit of rain today. We're not getting like the hurricane here where I, where I live, but we're getting just a bunch of rain where I live. So yeah, that's kind of what it is. But uh, so sorry about kind of like the darker lighting and stuff like that. So um. Anyway, so, uh, and by the way, I want to say just for everybody too, the, uh, the hurricane that just happened there a little while ago, uh, for people in Florida and stuff like that, you know, if any, uh, if any of you guys live out there, uh, definitely, I, I hope you guys are all right. I hope you guys are, uh, I hope you guys are good. I hope you guys are safe and, uh, you know, hopefully, uh, you know, everything went well or whatever, cause I know that hurricane really did some damage. So, um, but anyway, this character spotlight video, uh, so I just wanted to kind of mention that for this video because I know there's a lot of people that, uh, you know, went through the, uh, the crazy hurricane or whatever. So, uh, I live in Canada, so we don't get as much here. We really don't. This is just a bunch of rain here. So anyway, but uh, anyway, enough rambling. I just want to kind of add that to the beginning of the video. But uh, anyway, this character spotlight video was suggested by Cade Woody. So of course, everybody go subscribe to Cade Woody. He is one of my good friends here on YouTube and Definitely this one. Uh, I was like, oh man, like honestly, Kate, this is like the best suggestion ever. I really love this one. So, uh, because Connie is one of my new favorite characters in The Walking Dead. She has, uh, so basically, she came in in The Walking Dead season uh, nine, episode five, Rick's last episode at the very end. Uh, and then, of course, uh, all the way up to the season uh, nine finale. So, she hasn't been there too long, but she's been there, you know, for season nine. And so far, I really like her character. So, um, of course, her and uh, Magna and the others are introduced to Alexandria. Uh, you know, I like how she's kind of trying to teach Judah some sign language, of course. Um, they go to uh, the uh, the hilltop, of course, because, you know, Michonne just doesn't want to deal with them. After what happened in the Scars episode, she's kind of afraid uh, to let new people in. So, she takes them to hilltop uh, and doesn't know that Maggie's actually gone. Um... And on their way there, of course, we get to see uh, Bernie, who's one of their friends or whatever that they lost a couple days before Alexandria. So, uh, you know, uh, we get to see that, of course, and uh, we get, uh, you know, uh, to see them go to Hilltop. We get to see a little bit of the journey there with uh, the... Um violin and stuff like that uh with michonne you know like cutting it in two and all that kind of stuff but uh, basically they go there and uh you know uh she connie basically goes uh to uh help with the whispers and uh i, I really like when they're you know i mean because around this time they're kind of worried you know luke and alden they're out and jesus has just died and things like this so um she basically, uh, you know, her, Magna, Yumiko, and Kelly go after Luke, of course. Uh, they sneak out at night, and they realize it's not really the best decision that they have to go back. So, of course, they do, and uh, we get to see her get trapped in the cornfield when, uh, you know, Alpha kind of shows up with her whispers. So, uh, we get to see her re uh, rescue a baby, of course. Um... And I really like how, uh, I love the way that scene was done when she's running through the, the cornfields or whatever. And, uh, you know, you've got like, uh, it, it's like, you know, from what she, you know, hears or whatever, which is almost, you know, nothing at this point. And, uh, you know, I just, I don't know, I like how they did the kind of perspective of, uh, you know, kind of what, 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 you know, what she was hearing and, uh, you know, kind of the point of view shots as she's through the, going through the cornfields and stuff. Uh, Daryl and the others get to save her, of course, and, they take the uh, the baby in. So uh, I like that, of course. And then uh, we get to see uh, Henry take off. So Daryl and Connie both go after, uh, you know, uh, Henry. Um, and they kind of try to track him and stuff like that. And I love the part when they're going after him, they find, you know, Henry's staff and stuff. And I really like, too, how um, the dog kind of brings the arrow back, like Daryl, because Daryl shoots a zombie, dog takes the uh, the arrow out or whatever, uh, and, and brings the arrow to, to Daryl. And this was actually a, uh, a a blooper. This wasn't actually supposed to happen in the show. Uh, the dog, like, uh, uh, you know, uh, ripped the um, uh, arrow in half, and Daryl's just like, he kind of looks at Connie's like, 
and he's like, bad dog, you know, I don't know if you guys remember that scene, but there's a scene where dog, uh, you know, uh, you know, cuts, uh, one of the, uh, uh, you know, um, arrows in half, and he kind of, Daryl looks like, he's like, he looks at Connie, and she's like, and he's like, bad dog. So anyway, uh, I like that stuff, of course. And of course, they put the Whisper mask on uh, and they go through and they get to Henry and Lydia, which they're only there for Henry, but they get Lydia back too. Um, and they decide to take the uh, higher ground, of course. So they go into the uh, that building or whatever that's, uh, you know, uh, like the tons of like, uh, you know, stuff in it or whatever. It's kind of like an apartment building, but it's like being built. So uh, we got that, of course. And, uh, you know, you got Connie and she's like killing some of the whispers and stuff. Uh, she like ducks too. Like she just knows, you know, and she's killing tons of whispers and uh, saving Henry and stuff like that. Um, meanwhile, while Daryl is fighting Beta in the other room, so yeah, I just, I don't know, I like that, but, uh, we have all that stuff going through, and, uh, she, her and Daryl kind of start to develop a little bit of a, uh, bond for, you know, I mean, uh, well, they kind of, I feel like they're kind of trying to set up a bit of a relationship between Daryl and Connie, I feel like it's coming, so, We'll have to see, but uh, basically they go to Alexandria, of course, and then they go, you know, to the fair, and I love the part at the fair where Daryl, he, he leaves or whatever, and he's like, hey, you feed my dog, and she's like, you know, and they kind of, they have that moment between them, and I just, I don't know, I, I like the, the setup and what they're doing between Daryl and Connie, so, uh, we have that, of course, we have, um, the scene where, uh, you know, uh, Connie and Kelly talk or whatever about, uh, how Connie just left and she didn't say goodbye. Uh, we have the fair and all that stuff. And of course, uh, after that, I find that Connie kind of faded into the background a little bit. But, uh, of course, we see her in season 10, so she'll have a bit more time, it looks like, in, in The Walking Dead season 10. So, uh, they're definitely gonna need her, though, to fight the Whisper. She's really tough for sure. So, um, really like her character, you know? She could be a love interest for Daryl. We don't know. Is it finally time to see a love interest for Daryl? Will it be with Carol? or will it be with Connie? Um, kind of some interesting questions right now, but she's tough. I mean, honestly, she is a tough character. I love the part where she just ducks, you know? She just knows the whispers behind her, you know? So, I don't know. I love all that stuff. I love Connie's character, and uh, definitely season 10. Uh, I, I don't see them killing her off at any point in time. I think she's going to be a character they might keep for seasons to come, to be honest. So, um... Anyway, write your comments in the comment section below. What do you think about Connie's character in the series? And of course, what character spotlight do you want to see next week? Write that down in the comment section below. And of course, I will uh, pin your comment on the top. Uh, you got to be the first one to comment and the first one to suggest the next character spotlight. So definitely make it quick because I know there's, there's a lot of people trying to, you know, suggest them pretty much all at the same time. So uh, I can only pick one. So, you know, I have to pick the one that uh, commented first. So, um... Anyway, so yeah, definitely be quick with that because uh, I know there's a lot of people suggesting character spotlights. And uh, of course, this one, Connie, thank you very much to Cade Woody for suggesting this character spotlight video. And what character spotlight video do you guys want to see next week? Write that down in the comment section. So if you're new here, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my Walking Dead videos. And of course, I will catch you guys really soon for another. Peace out.